So what do you do when your business is booming but you can't find enough engineers to help you increase your output to satisfy that growing demand for your product? Well today I'm at Bell Engineering with Paul Robson. Paul and his colleagues have been facing this problem for some time, leading the company to address it in a pretty radical way. Yes, they've set up their very own training academy and I've come to Newcastle to see it. So my name is Paul Robson, I'm the general manager here at Bell Engineering. Bell Engineering is one of eight businesses that make up the British Engines Group. Predominantly here at Bell Engineering, we cover sectors such as nuclear, defence, oil and gas and aerospace. As with all businesses in the UK, I believe, you find it hard to get a high skilled machinist that can cover all the aspects that you're looking for. So we took a business decision to invest more in the apprenticeships and our apprentices coming into the business. So last year we took on five apprentices, this year we're taking on 13. The plan for next year is to grow that to 15 and 20 going forward. To do that, they need some support and structure behind that. So we decided to invest in what you can see here is the training facility, the training academy, to support our apprentices when they come on site to give them a good grounding before they actually go into the machine shop and are adding value. And when you're setting up a training academy, you also need to make sure that you're offering your students and your apprentices the technologies that they need that are going to be suited to industry outside of this workplace. So here in the training academy, you can see behind us, we've got a DMG Mori Vertical Machining Centre. We've also got a DMG Mori Lathe. Um, we've got other machining centres around us that will give a good baseline and introduction to what we do in this plan for our apprentices. What, what we are doing with the apprentices is we're giving them all a project that they're going to oversee from cradle to grave. So that will include the purchasing and, uh, of the material, the design of it, the writing the programs, coming in, doing all the manufacture, and then ensuring that it's correct of the drone. So they'll be doing mechanical and CMM inspection themselves. That will go upstairs and it'll be signed off by a member of the SMT team to prove that they've completed that project to the level we expect to get out of them. As the Managing Director of DMG Moray, um, we are delighted to be involved with Bell Engineering and their Training Academy. It's super important that actually industry realise how we can train the younger generation and if they don't stay here, they'll move to the wider world and look at some of the technologies that are available for them. So our opportunity to work with uh, Jonathan and his project on the Academy here is, is absolutely crucial to our future but also very, very enjoyable. So some of the advantages that we've seen already in the Training Academy is the guys are working on work that is not being sold to the customer. And you might think that's a bit strange but what enables them to do is make mistakes. They can learn from the mistakes that they're doing. Um, they have support whenever they need it. There's a full-time trainer in, based in this cell. Um, they're always there for them. So it also gives them access to the latest technology. It gives them more structure to the training. And really, it safeguards the future of the business. Mm -hmm.